This is All Things Acura. Again, I'm Matt. And I'm Justin. And uh, I, I don't know if we're going through our whole spiel about who we are. Um, you know, watch the last one, I guess. Watch, <laughs> yeah. Acura announced some um, pricing got, on the 23 RDX. Yeah, we got limited time on this one, so we gotta we gotta hurry it along. So <laughs> they're they're all saying, "Thank God." I know. <laughs> Yeah, Dang. sorry. I mean, see, here we go again. That's fine. But anyway, <laughs> so the goal of this one, uh, just real quickly, um, is to talk a little bit about the PMC TLX, which we talked in a couple episodes ago. Uh, the PMC TLX, that is. Uh, and then the RDX, the pricing on that. So, Justin, whatever you want to lead off with. Well, I could announce okay. the pricing on the 23 RDX uh, just a week or so ago. Uh, <clears throat> and they started production or they will start production pretty soon um so depending on when this comes out it's going to be real close i mean yeah. there's still a couple more 22s in the system and then the 23s will start rolling out yep. keep in mind there are some uh i'll just sort out real quick just an idea because you're you want to probably know what the price difference is but there are still some little bit incentives on the 22s which yep. we'll talk about towards the end so i don't want to forget that yes so um, so the price increase on the 2023s, which like Justin said, there's, um, I know we just have a handful left of the 2022s coming. I think it's just like three or four of them. Um, so it was 750 and I thought it was different for different ones. Unless I'm wrong here, my, by my calculations at 750, um, it was the increase across the board. I don't know. Maybe I went through all of them. It says 750. So maybe I was wrong on the one when I said 900. I thought it was Which, a little higher. But. So we, we kind of anticipated a little bit more than that. And I, mm -hmm. not because we wanted it to be more, but just because it changes every year. And they added a couple extra things to the 23 as far as yeah. what you get. Not so many as features. Because keep in mind that the 22 was the mid-model refresh for the RDX. So they made some changes for 22. They're carrying, obviously, those changes over to 23. But there's no real changes to the vehicle yeah 23 is going to be the same to my knowledge i mean obviously who knows when the car comes out um to what we know it's going to be the same so what they did add was two services uh so new standard premium services was to the acura link so you get three years complimentary which is awesome so before if uh, i know we talked about this before but it was only six months of that service so that includes thing well it goes kind of all the way up to the concierge the concierge you do only get for six months on the trial but you do get all the way up to the remote packages for the three years which is great that's the one if you're not familiar with it most cars manufacturers they have some type of uh feature or app that goes along with the vehicle whether you can so in this one ours you can remote start your car you can lock and unlock it you can locate it on a map you can set geofencing, speed alerts. There's lots of really cool things that you could do. I love the remote start capability because you could do it from anywhere. Anywhere, yeah. Yeah, which is kind of a cool service because after that, if you want to continue that, it's $110 a year. So that is a nice service. You know, you can kind of consider that to be, you know, about a $300 value. Right. Um, so they that. before you got a six-month trial. Mm -hmm. So on previous actors, you got a six-month trial. On the 23, now three years of it are included. Yep, absolutely, which is kind of cool. We did my, I did my first at least the other day of the – of uh, 2023 and I'm like and they're releasing and I'm like oh that's kind of cool you get that for the, the three years I didn't even like I knew that oh, but I was like oh that kind of makes sense like, it's kind of cool um the other thing that again that Acura is offering and they kind of said this about 2023s but they are making the official announcement about yep. that RDX is that you get the two uh the two years or 24,000 miles of the uh factory scheduled maintenance so that's that's an important thing too and I, I don't know, on two years on an RDX, you're you know looking at two, three hundred dollars in terms of service on that, uh, which is, I mean, that's a nice value too. So, you know, 300 plus, let's just call it 300, so like 600 some bucks that they're giving you. So they're all pretty much almost making up that cost. Yeah. So in a day, mm -hmm. in an age of where everything's gone up in price and when they do get a chance to bring out a new model, they're obviously, they want to try to raise the price, which they do every, every year, whether it's now when we don't want them to. Uh, or 10 years ago, they always have. Yeah. And so now they're trying to give you something at least for what, what, where that price increase is coming. So yeah. And I think it's pretty cool. I know we've always kind of talked about that, like putting little things in there with Acura saying, Hey, you know, this, you know, can we give people something like, you know, it's always that kind of thing, but I think that's just enough to kind of, you know, make you feel good about that. So that's really cool. Something, um, but keep in mind the 2023, 2022s have some of those incentives. So I don't know if you, if you want to talk about that after the RDX or the PMC. Yeah, we could touch on that. I know the uh, 22 still have some incentives on them, which are, are few and far between in this climate right now. But obviously there aren't many incentives from the manufacturers and, and they still have a thousand dollar loyalty rebate. So if you have an Acura that's 2012 or newer, 
in your household, you qualify for that thousand dollars. You don't have to trade it, don't have to replace it. Yeah. Um, you do get that. And they do have a special financing available on that vehicle currently as well. Um, and they are offering um, some lease incentives. So uh, they have some decent incentives on that 22. And the reason why I point that out is because a lot of people say, well, at this point, why don't I just get a 23? Right. And probably not wrong in a lot of cases, but keep in mind, you, you are getting that those that extra incentive plus yeah. $750 less price. So really $1,750 now. Yeah. So oh, yeah, for sure. It's And it's the same car. I mean, right. all That's, things being said, it's the right. same. And they, haven't come, they haven't come out with the 23 thing. I don't even look at that. No, the 23 thing. Thing. Okay, so do nothing yet. All right, great. So... Um, that's it on the RDX. PMC TLX. Did you guys get yours? Did you get yours? Get your TLX. Did you, the one the of, red one. The one of 50. The red one. One of 50? One of 100. 300? Right. Oh, yeah. I was like, wait a second. Right. One of 300. One of 300. Assuming all were right. available. <laughs> um, right. So, the red was already, already passed. So, if you wanted red. Sorry. It's sold out with, what did you say? Within a, under an hour. Under an hour. Okay. Under an hour. Jeez. So that was on mm. October 6th. So your next chance will be white. Yep. 130R white. If you're not familiar with that color, you can do a little research on it. It is white. Yeah, it's, 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 flat it's white. not pearl white. It's not platinum white pearl. It's not matte white. It's not a matte white. It's a flat. It's just white with no yep. pearl metallic Flake, Anything. nothing. Pure. It's pure. It's sharp. I, I mean, I, to be fair, I haven't seen of, it, but I, I like the picture. I think it's <laughs> neat because everything's a pearl metallic something now. Yeah. And so you now unwind all that and just yeah. go to yeah, white. I think that's it's great. Kind of it looks sporty. I don't know. Um, so that's that. So that will be Wednesday, November 9th. Same thing, same time. 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Mm, that's right. And is it 11? Is it 10? 10, 10. 10. No, 10. 10, Pacific 11, time. 12. Yes. <laughs> 10, and 10. that reserve tool will open for that, and there will be a hundred of those available on that date. And then if you're ha- holding out for the blue, that'll be in December. December 8th will be Long Beach Blue Pearl. I'm curious. I, I know we can't do that, but I'm curious to know how that goes, right? Are you like clicking and like if someone if someone ordered one, if you put in the comments what that looked like, I'm cu- like, are you like yeah, refreshing? Like, did, did or you like, have to did you have to put your yeah. stuff in multiple times? Did you yeah. get kicked out? Did the yeah. system bog down? I didn't hear any feedback on this one other than they sent out a um, <laughs> a little message saying that it was sold out. Uh, you know, and that was kind of later in the day, uh, so that it had actually sold out under an hour. And I think just point that out just because. If you are interested, don't wait. Like, don't say, oh, well, sometime today I should go and do this. No. So be, be at your computer, yeah. the fastest one you have yeah. uh, at that time, and, and give it a whirl. The because fastest one you have. They even suggested that if, you know, maybe have multiple people trying for you. Yeah. Um, it, and if you want the blue, you, that's a definite. I I see that being. Yeah, that's a, only 100. I mean, that's like. 100. 100 yeah. across. I mean. That's the it. Country. I mean, the country. That's you <laughs> know then, two um, per state. Oh yeah, the blue. The thir- for, so for the blue one, it's Thursday, December eighth. Oh, we right. So right. So the the white is on a Wednesday. I didn't even realize that. Oh, weird. So, yeah. I wasn't paying attention. I wasn't interesting. either. So, um, so th- just keep that in your back pocket. It's coming up here really quickly. Um, we might put on another small announcement just, just as a reminder to make sure if you're interested, you get on that. Um, you know, there might be a handful of these units floating around uh, from the dealers available to get. But other than that, I, I don't know that you'll be able to get one any other way. Yeah. So, I, yeah. Who knows? Reserve tool. But that's it. I mean, RDX yep. pricing announced. It'll be coming right down the road, not too far away. PMC TLX yep. Type S. And next time, uh, I don't know, there could be more news, but uh, I know we didn't want to necessarily talk about inventory updates. There wasn't really many changes to it, um, but just keep an eye out for things. Again, thank you so much for, for watching, listening, however you're consuming us. We appreciate it. And uh, if you have any comments or questions, uh, feel free to leave them in the in the comment section if you're watching on YouTube. I'm not sure how to look at comments if there's, if there's a possible thing on the podcast, but I'll have to look at 
<laughs> yeah, I don't know. I think they might have sent us those. I'm not sure that there is, but that could be. Open. We're always we're here. learning. We're, yeah, and we're real people. So again, we appreciate it. Like, subscribe. Thank you guys so much. Uh, we appreciate it, and um, we'll see you guys next time. Sounds good. Talk to you soon.